What's Up Wednesday. I'm John Hill, and I'm going to talk to you today about how you can become a prompt engineer to make your teaching life so much easier. So let's go in here and in two, sim in two sentences and put simply, what is a prompt engineer? Prompt engineer is someone who designs and formulates specific instructions or queries used to elicit desired responses or actions from an AI system, often focusing on refining language prompts to achieve optimal performance and outcomes. And we'll stop right there. Many of you have already been using BARD or ChatGPT to write lesson plans or refine lesson plans or create more instructional opportunities for your students. Let me show you how easy we can make that if you become a little bit of a amateur prompt engineer. Okay, so first of all, it's all about having resources to help to help you do that. So let me let me point out a resource that I'm going to give you a link to in the description of this video. Um, so a prompt engineer has to use words to refine the search, to really tell the chatbot what it needs to go get from the internet, from, from, from the World Wide Web. So we've created at Trevera this engineering and AI prompt for teachers template. And all you have to do is follow this template and you're going to get the most detailed um, returns on what you're putting in to chat and, and your requests for lesson materials. So let me show you what happens when you give chat sort of a very, very vague, um, you know, request. So here's the first one. So I need a third grade lesson on the rainforest. Let's see what happens when we type that in. Now, right away, you're going to notice very creative, pretty detailed. And if you take the time to read through this lesson or whatever you would get from your initial qu uh, query without using too much detail, you're going to get a pretty great lesson. You're going to get um, something you perhaps wouldn't think of yourself. You're going to get all the aspects of the lesson from materials, probably an assessment, everything you need. However, if you go ahead and start thinking like a prompt engineer and you start getting real detailed about what you're asking for, you're going to get a way better response. So for example, we made this little tool right here. Here it is bigger. And that same rainforest request I just made to chat, let's go in and, and, and refine that and decide what do we want it to create specifically and for what audience? Do we want it aligned to any standards? What's the subject? What do we want it to include? Tell it anything you want to include. More than one thing, more than three things. Don't forget to modify or extend the lesson. And I promise you, when you add that level of detail, you're going to get a much more detailed response. So let's, let's do that. So now I've put in, create a lesson for third grade students aligned to ISTE standards on the topic of rainforests. Include STEAM and extension activities for diverse learners and advanced students. Let's see what we get. we are going to get an infinitely more comprehensive return and we're going to get exactly what we need. So it's just going to be that much more of a time saver. This is how you really transform instruction. This is how you save time because teachers, one thing that they don't have a lot of at the end of the day is, is extra time. So definitely take advantage of this, of this um, tool that we created. Again, the link uh, for it will be below. I highly recommend you start using this as you use um, chatbots like BARD and ChatGPT in your instruction and your lesson planning. Okay, thanks everybody. Bye.